welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing an unbagging. So this is from FG Normal. So thank you to FG Normal for sending me these items for review. So let's see what I got. So I think I got like a couple items. Mysterious box, diamond painting, another diamond painting, diamond painting. Okay, right. that's everything. So Let's do the not so mysterious items. Oh, 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 so I got, I don't think I, I'm not sure if I ordered this. I think they might have just thrown it in. So this first thing, it's a diamond painting tray. So it's clear, so I don't know if you can see it. So I, oh, I know. I'll use mysterious box as my backdrop here. Can you, no, can you still see it? Um, it's, it's a clear tray. Um, it has like a, can you see there's a divider here? Um, so, you know, if you wanted to diamond paint two colors at the same time, you could put some in here and some in there, and it looks like it has a clasp thing here to that closes it down. So if you're a vigorous shaker like I am, you know, maybe this is something you want to try out. So, you know, just for comparison's sake, here's a Mosfa tray. Um, yeah, it looks about the size of a Mosfa tray. Um, it has higher sides than a Mosfa tray. Um, but yeah, I don't, I don't actually, no, wait, I have a diamond art club. Um, I don't, I was like, I don't have any clear trays, but yeah, no, um, but yeah, I was like, hmm, I might try this out. I'm not, I don't typically do more than one color at the same time, but this might actually be good for, um, a special shape one where I tend to have no I don't know I'll have to try it out it does say on the listing that this is supposed to be stackable so I do see the some ridges here at the bottom but without having a second one <laughs> I can't tell you if it is stackable oh I do see there's a do you see this um, ridge here and then there's like a hole here so I wonder if they're stackable not like on top of each other but they could like snap together and you could have like multiple trays just connected to each other so I kind of wish <laughs> I had a second one so I could see if it'll snap together but yeah this might be interesting to try out so so this is okay so FG normal their prices are in pounds so this is 99.99 um, .99 pounds so I don't know what their cents are called I, I would say it's 99 cents but it's in pounds so 0.99 pounds so there's that um well, let's just do the box since it's out here so mysterious box considering I, I know what non-diamond painted related thing I bought okay so Okay, so this is a diamond painting wreath. This is the first time I've, like, I have never actually gotten a diamond painting wreath before, but yeah, it looks like it's in the box and in some bubble wrap. It actually, so it's a, oh, I don't know if this broke. Did this break? Do you see this? It looks like it might have broken. So even though the box, this, okay, so maybe the box did get squished right here. Do you see this indentation here? So the wreath looks like it might have broken in the back. Um, but is this magnetic? It seems... No, I don't think this is magnetic. Um, is there a hole to hang the stuff? But yeah, it's supposed to be a diamond painting wreath. I actually thought it looked really, really, like, cute. So I was like, I need to try this out. So... Um, I don't know if you could tell, um, there is, it's all cut out, so that's kind of nice, um, and I mean, if you peel back the plastic, yes, it's very sticky, I don't normally do that, why do I do that? Um, but yeah, this is, um, a fall wreath, um, my lights are kind of glaring on it, so I might turn off these lights, but yeah, it's a fall wreath, and... These are special shapes, so it did come with the normal toolkit. And um, 
there's some special shapes here and it looks like the there since there's no legend on this it looks like the legend i don't know if you can see it see it's s n there and p there so i'm guessing there is an n there's an n there and there's a p there so there is since there's no legend the the symbols are on the drill bags which is nice so yeah here's the first item this lovely wreath um kind of sad that it's broken in the back but I don't know what's holding it together here, but I'll I'll probably just glue this. I have plenty of I have I could probably hot glue this thing. Um But yeah, I'll but yeah, this is really pretty. I think yeah. I'm excited to do this one. I've never done a diamond painting wreath. So yeah, there's the first item. Let me move this off to the side. Um so that I don't further break it um so the next item oh yeah wait the wreath it's um 12.99 in pounds on their website so the next item is um i got a shopping bag um i've done a shopping bag before but i saw this one and i was like oh i love i like i like the owls um it's just a cute shopping bag so it looks very similar to a shopping bag I had gotten before. Um, it is, um, maybe um, Americans like things bigger, but it is smaller than a normal shopping bag you would normally get. But I was like, oh, look, it's owls. I really like, I like animal diamond paintings as long as they're on the cutesy side and not like they're gonna, they look like they're gonna eat you. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I was like, oh, look at the cute little owls. I was like, oh. So I got that one, and so this is also another special shape one. Um, does it look like the symbols? Okay, so the symbols are just one number, so I'm guessing it's just going to correspond to the symbols, I mean, to the numbers on the bags here. This does look like... There are a couple special shapes in here, otherwise it mostly looks like normal diamond painting drills. But yeah, no, I thought, I was like, oh, look at the cute owl. I might, yeah, I might change out some of these. If they're white, I might change those out to ABs. I just think that would look really good. Oh, so I am going to try to finish this one um, before this video gets posted. So you should stick around to the end. And I can't see why I wouldn't be able to finish this. But yeah. So there's the second item, and the owl bag is $4.99 in pounds. So next item. So yeah. Yeah, FG Normal let me like choose several items. So I was like, thanks. So okay, so the next item was partially open. So okay, I got everything. So so this item. So normal toolkit. Um, so this item is a full rhinestone diamond painting. So if you've watched a couple of my previous videos, I have been kind of getting into the rhinestone bandwagon. So yeah, so here is the image. Um, it's a little bit crumpled, but I think you get what it is, right? It's these cactuses, cacti, cactus, cac cacti. I think that's the right word, cacti. They're... So yeah, it's these cactuses. I don't know, does it say something? No. I'm trying to see if it's like this. Yeah, no, I was like, okay, don't mind me. I was just looking at it. So um, this cactus is supposed to be a 30 by 40 but let's see what it is it's about 35 or 37 millimeters so wait what am i talking about it's oh my gosh why can't i read um don't mind me um it's about 33 and a half um centimeters across and 24 that way so yeah i thought i was like oh they're they have crystal rhinestones and i 
I was like, I have to try them. So yeah, I think... I'm still trying to see if this says something. <laughs> okay, so there is a 21 colors in this one. It looks like pretty simple, lots of symbols. Um, like, like there's a little swirly in there. Um, so I'm guessing there's going to be whatever the rhinestone equivalent of white is, a lot of that in the background. Um, but yeah, I think the symbols look pretty clear on this one, so I don't have any... I don't think I have any issues with this one. So yeah, I thought, ooh, rhinestones. I have to try different sources of full rhinestone diamond paintings because why not, right? So, oh wait, you know, I don't think I measured the wreath. So in case you want to know how big this wreath is, um, it's, it's about 30 by... Yeah, it's about about 30 by 30. The longest parts of it are about 30 by 30. So it's actually a good size. So I kind of want to say I want to finish this before I post the video, but this actually looks like it has a lot of drills, but I am going to start it. So if I somehow finish this before I post this video, you'll see it at the end. Okay, so there's the, the next one. And the cactus is $4.99. Um, in pounds. <laughs> I have no idea how much this in dollars. It's will be more than that in dollars since But don't ask me for the conversion <laughs> Okay, so next item Okay. So next item is another diamond painting this should be a 40 by 40 um, round drill, um, so it's the normal toolkit, but a little bit more wax than the other ones. Um, and I said this was round drills, and it is this. It's these leaves. I, I think these are like, what, lotus leaves, right? Um, I could be wrong, but I just like the image. Um, I do like, I do like plant pictures, um, and, and apparently in this one, I also wanted my cactus pictures. I wonder if sometimes if when I'm in um, choosing mode, I have like certain moods and and at the time of this diamond painting choosing, I was like, I want some plants. So yeah, here is um, this lovely leaf, lotus leaf image. So, so yeah, it does have 25 colors. It looks like it's all numbers and letters, which I love because those are, I think, the easiest to diamond paint with, at least for me. And there are DMC numbers, and there's 25 colors. And I think you know what I might do on this one. I don't know what color this these stems are, but I was like, hmm, maybe I could just change some of it to my gold. Um, I have some gold drills. So, yeah, I thought I got a lot of times now... Now that I guess I've been diamond painting more to entertain myself more, I I purposely choose images that I think I could bling up. So um, yeah, I think I could bling this up by putting in some gold rhinestones for the the stems or something. I don't know. We'll see. It 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 sometimes changes when you actually start diamond painting it. So yeah. So this is a forty by forty. Um, where's my tape measure? I had it. Um, wow, I am so disorganized in this um, unboxing. Probably because I was unboxing so many. So yeah, this is about a little bit less, more less than thirty-five, and and it, but it's thirty-five this way. So it's about it's a thirty-five by thirty-five. And did I show you the symbol quality? If it'll focus, I think the symbol quality looks really good. Yeah, so I think this is going to be a little bit more confetti than I thought it would be, but eh. You know, after doing like really confetti heavy diamond paintings, confetti is just like, eh. And plus, you know, confetti, you don't notice when your drills aren't as straight and when if it's confetti for whatever reason. It's the color blocking where you can notice where the drills are, like, wonky. So, yeah, it does look like, um, 
Let's look like that. The drills do have the DMC numbers on them and the um, item number. I don't know if it's focusing and you'll be able to see that, but but yeah. So this these leaves are six ninety nine in pounds. And in case you forgot everything else I showed you, so there's that. There is the cactus picture. Um, here is the really cute owl picture. And here is the wreath. And oh yeah, don't forget the trays. And if I do finish, I'm, I'm sure I'm gonna finish this. Um, so, so, so stick around to the end and um, see the finish of this. All right. So we're back. Um, this is the owl shopping bag finished. Um, so yeah, I think I think it looks really, really awesome. I did replace the white drills with AB drills. But yeah, otherwise, it's a really cute image. This was so, like, it, it, I diamond painted this really, really quickly, but it was really fun to do, and it's such a cute image. And I don't even, I, yeah, so there were 10 colors in this, and all four being special shapes. So yeah, um, I don't really have anything to say. It's really, really awesome. I have nothing, I had no problems with this. It is such a cute um, bag. Yeah, it's so cute. So yeah, I did actually, I seemed to power through it because it was really fun. Um, also, I did the wreath. So, so yeah, this is the fall wreath. And, um, this is really, really beautiful. Like, it's, it's pretty much, okay, so there were, let's see, 19 colors in all, seven of them being special. Um, I did j finish this just today, which I'm recording on May 31. So it's really beautiful. If you remember from the unboxing, I did, well, this is still the unboxing video. Um, I, it was broken in the back and um, this wasn't actually as shiny black, but, but there was like a film in the back that I took off and that's what this backing looks like. So I did try to use hot glue. Um, I don't recommend if this, if you do get this item and it breaks, don't use hot glue. Hot glue is just too thick. So when I tried to close it in, it, it was just too thick. So there is a little bit of a weird dip here, but I still just diamond painted over it. I mean, it's it's securely in there. I still did diamond paint over it, and you can't really tell that it was broken right there, but but yeah, no, I was able to hot glue the thing, but maybe next time if this, there is, I was kind of afraid to take off the hot glue and further break it, so um, I, I would use a thinner glue. I don't know what glue, but but yeah, here, it's really beautiful. Do you see? It's so beautifully sparkly. I did notice that there was no drill on in the inside of the the birdhouse, but then it's not sticky either. So I was very tempted to like use one of my other leftover drills and put something in there. But yeah, it's really, really beautiful, this fall wreath. Um, I did have a couple issues with this. Um, so these, the... The symbols had guide circles, so it was actually pretty hard. I don't know if you could tell. Um, you could see the black outline around the where the drills are, um, or you know whatever color outline they did. So for most of them, it didn't really matter because they would do an outline that's a similar color. For, but for the clear one, they used the black one, so you could see it. But you do, you don't really see it unless you really look at it. Um, so like if you're not a, if you don't place these things perfectly, which it's it's a lot harder to place these ones perfectly with with these not just being in a grid because then you don't have the other diamond drills like shoving it into place. So yeah, this was this actually took me much longer than I thought just because it's a mostly a single placing um, diamond painting. So yeah, so it was hard to cover all the the symbols. Oh, and, and then the the drills 
came labeled as like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then A, B, C, D, F, and then and so on. But um, so the the drill bags came labeled as A, B, C, D, F. So then I that's what I wrote on my labels here. But then when you were looking at the drill field here, they were actually labeled 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that was a little weird, but it was easy enough to figure out that that's what happened. Um, and then, oh yeah, so then I also ran out of, it, it doesn't look like I ran out, but I have only five left of these clear um, marquees that show up right here. I ran out of these clear marquees. I actually needed six for this portion here, but I only had five. So I ended up picking it out and then using the blue marquees instead because I had plenty of the blue marquees left. So, so I mean, and I, I tried looking through my stash and I don't have any of these kind of marquees in the same size. So. Um, but the one good thing is there were the blue ones. I contemplated using the purple ones, but I think I didn't have as many purple ones left. Yeah, I didn't have that many purple ones left. So I ended up using the blue marquees for this flower here, because, but, but it was supposed to be clear like this. But I thought it still looks very beautiful. So that was my main issue with this. But yeah, other than that... Um, Strangely, there were some colors I had so much left of, and then somewhere I was like, I only have two left. Um, so I don't know, maybe the machine that was pouring these things in didn't pour ev everything correctly, I don't know. But even with those issues, this thing is absolutely beautiful. So yeah. So thank you to FG Normal for sending me these items for review. and. Thank you for watching and happy diamond painting. Bye.